Hey, what's going on, guys? Goose here, man, and got some uh, video for you. Got some news, LSU football news. As uh, not really a surprise uh, that uh, LSU has picked their offensive coordinator, and they're picking co-offensive coordinators, Cortez Hankton and Joe Sloan. Of course, they were the uh, coordinators uh, in the bowl game. They shared the duties of being the offensive coordinator. Uh, I'm not really too hip on having uh, co-offensive coordinators or co-defensive coordinators, stuff like that. But, uh, I mean, I mean, I always think that you always have to have one guy to be the coordinator, whether it's offensive or defense. But this is the route they're going, and this is a route that the uh, that uh, is probably going to be for you know for at least at least a year, at least a year. Uh, you know, I guess I guess they. Um, I know they. I know they didn't want. They, I know they didn't want to lose Joe Sloan to somewhere else, and they didn't want. And I don't think they want to lose Cortez uh, Hankton uh, either. So this was probably the best way to keep both of them on staff um, for at least next year. But um, that's so uh, that's the news, man. There's uh, Cortez Hankton, Joe Sloan. They're your co-offensive coordinators for LSU now. So uh, now now the staff is complete. Uh, with the defensive staff, uh, they hired last week, or they made, or they made an announcement last week. It was known for a while that uh, of uh, who the, who they were going to hire for you know, for the defensive coordinator, and uh, when I mean it was known for a while that that uh, Corey Raymond was going to come back. It just uh, they wanted to wait till they hired everybody or, or announced everybody. In that note, but all right, that's it, man. Not much, like I said, not not much, not much to say, man. But Cortez Hankton. Joe Sloan, they're your uh, co-offensive coordinators for 2024. And uh, our staff is complete. Now let's see if they can uh, – no, they've got a lot, a, lot of a, a lot of parts to replace. Uh, no, of course, uh, no Jane Daniels, no Malik Neighbors, no Brian Thomas on offense. And everybody knows how the defense was just atrocious last year. So uh, I'm expecting the defense to be better this year. I mean, it, it can't get any worse. But uh, go Tigers.